Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red. As always, I am Nixalon, this is Red, and today we're going into the power plant. Ooh, look at this creepy-ass place. Why are there industrial, like, oil barrels? It's kind of weird. Hey, are you a Voltorb? Of course you are. Well, I can't catch you, so go to hell. Screech sucks. Nice. Paris doing work. Alright. We're getting into this. Oh, that wasn't the item. That was just a random encounter. Sweet. Oh, max potion. Hell yeah. Oh, let's suddenly turn up. Look at these little things. They look like little faces. Little creepy computer faces. I mean, I know they're supposed to look like the old 1960s. I don't know, 60s. Uh, 1970s. Whenever computers first came out, like the really old big ones that took up whole rooms. At least I presume that's their purpose. Oh shit, yeah. We're catching this. Uh, <laughs> like, I was like, how do you put people to sleep? Spore. <laughs> that's how you put people to sleep. Oh, we got a freaking, we're gonna get a freaking magneton. Don't, don't you do that. Stop being paralyzed. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be sweet. I'm not even gonna attack you. You're just getting, you get in the ball. Ah, uh, let's see. Come on. Oh, you son of a bitch. Stay asleep, yes. We can do this. I have faith in us. The return of Uppy. Uh, it didn't work at all. Uppy failed us. That's actually true. He died. Oh, now I'm sad. <laughs> I hadn't thought about Uppy for a while. He never got to evolve. <sighs> Come on. No, don't wake up. Okay, that's fine. No, don't. He needs to be asleep. What other move do you have? Are you going to struggle? Is Thunder Wave your only move at level 31? Like, what is happening right here? Okay, you got Spark. I'm just resistant to it. That's actually really good for me being resistant. Can you please hit with... Thank you. Quick Claw and Spore, same turn. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. No instant wake-ups. I like this. If I go through two more Ultra Balls and this thing has not been caught, I'm just throwing a Master Ball at it. You are a pain in my ass. You are just freaking annoying. Sonic Boom, 64, that's fine. I, I looked up, I didn't look at the map, but I looked up the Pokemon that we could get in here between episodes. And I was really excited because, like, oh, we can get a Pikachu or a Magnemite. Like, those are the two most common Pokemon. Of course, the first one we see is a Voltor, which you already have. It's like, well, shit, you. But then a Magneton? Like, I think it's like a 5 or 10% chance. Dude, you're mine. <laughs> I don't even care. No. Just get the freaking Master Ball. I caught a Magneton. That's how you use Master Balls to catch Magnetons. <laughs> That's how we do it here. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Screw Magnemites. We just go straight for the evolution. What are we gonna name Magneton? Ah. Uh, I have no idea. Uh. I don't know. I'm gonna name him Trio. That's a really awful name. And I apologize. But I can't think of anything better. I was not expecting a Magneton. So, oh. And now, we can use Repels. So, if you see Mystic Water here, what I did is I took Mystic Water off of Guppy. And I gave him a Berry. Joey still has the Cleanse Tag, because, I mean, it's the best we have. We're just going to go around and collect stuff. And, oh, Guppy, shit. <laughs> that just made me think of like Binding of Isaac. If you if you're unfamiliar with the Binding of Isaac game, it's 
That's not a item. Oh shit, Electro. <laughs> this this may be bad. Let's uh let's hyper thing. Let's try to live this. Hopefully he doesn't kill us. Um shit. Shit 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 shit. Oh Joey, I love you. Oh my god. I was so scared for a second. I really I was like, we're gonna lose Joey. Oh, you get healed, like, right the hell now. So, the the main character, Isaac, in Binding of Isaac, there's lots of references to his cat, who's also named Guppy, which is why they reminded me of that. Anyways, I've been playing Binding of Isaac a lot. Um, I've got a little backlog built up, so it's going to go up on, uh, well, it's been going up, and will continue to go up on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So I've got Pokemon here, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then Binding of Isaac, Tuesday, Thursday... And it was just announced this past week that the new Binding of Isaac game. That's so fascinating. Oh, yes. That's a terrible electric move. Thunder is bad because while it's stronger than Thunderbolt, I think it's 95 power to 120. Its accuracy drops from 100 to 70%. So it's totally not worth the power increase. Um, ever. At all. Like, no chance. So let's go investigate over here. Oh, wait, what's up here? Oh, two items. One of you is an Electro? No, Thunderstone. If I had caught a Pikachu, I would have a Raichu. But I didn't. Caught a Magneton. Don't be another Electrode. Shit. Well, we know that he can survive one, don't we? Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't crit. Okay, he's going with rollout. We got this then. Because now he's locking to roll out for five turns, or until he misses. And strength is more accurate, but the same power as Hyper Fang. It just doesn't crit as much. Doesn't have a higher crit ratio, so... Suck that, Electrode. I'm done with your bullshit. Anyways, it was just announced last week that the new Binding of Isaac game, Rebirth, Binding of Isaac Rebirth, is due out in November? November 4th? October 4th? I think it's November 4th, though. Um, yeah, so I'll probably play that once I, like, quote-unquote beat the first one, which I'm still working on. I'm not sure what quote-unquote beat means, but... Hey, look! It's Zapdos! <laughs> oh, we're here to kill you, sir. We are here to kill you. Um, Electric is special, so there's no point in sending Guppy out. Unless he has Drill Pack. In which case, there's no point in sending Guppy out and switching to Jeff. Are you ready to die, sir? Let's do this thing. Cow! I'm sure... I feel like the legendary... Trio... No, because... I was wondering if they're going to be back in, in Heart Gold and Soul Silver. I don't think they are. We should not be in. I was like, I'll just attack once and then switch. That's an awful plan. We took out Articuno. We'll take out Zapdos. I ain't afraid of shit. Ah! <laughs> Cherry Berry. That's, that's actually probably... Not good. I wonder what his ability is. As long as he doesn't have, um... I forget what it's called, but there's an electric move. Not an electric move. There's an ability that makes it so that you absorb electric attacks. Motor drive? No, that speed... Yeah. Motor drive does. But that's just one of them. I think there's actually probably two or three. Huh. I didn't even realize that. Oh no! Well, that's fine. Continue using protect, detect, not protect, detect. That's fine. My dream meter wouldn't have worked anyways. I'm really not liking this multiple agility thing. Uh, how much is Psychic doing on its own? That's not good. Can we get another hypnosis? Okay, so now he's maxed his speed. So if he can Oko people, we're kind of screwed. I don't think he can, because we're fully EV trained, or mostly EV trained. 
and he's not. So we can't really paralyze him, but I think if we can just, I think if we can keep up with the dream eating, unless he has a berry. You don't have a berry, do you? Nice. Okay. Yeah. Maybe, maybe Drowsy and Hypnos are ninjas. <laughs> Oh, sexy! Another one bites the dust. Uh, yeah. I noticed on uh, someone commented on my battle with Koga that you know, Drowsy and Hypno knocking people out is actually kind of a ninja move. I think we just confirmed that. Jeff's a ninja. That was awesome. And now we're going back to Cinnabar Island. So we've got two down. The third one is in Victory Road, which we need to get eight badges for. And what I want to do is I'm going to go into Pokemon Mansion and start working through that now. I, I actually was expecting the power plant. I feel like it took longer when I was a kid, but that's probably because I can use repels. I wasn't like, I'm done with these things. But yeah, what, where are we sitting? We already caught a Pokemon in there. Shades needs the experience. We'll sit him up front. So I think I think my current plan here is to go into Pokemon, go into Pokemon Mansion, Cinnabar Mansion, whatever this place is called, Pokemon Mansion. So we're gonna go through here because we gotta get the key to get into Blaine's spot. And I'm not sure if this is gonna be a two-parter or not. I don't remember how like complicated this is. So. Oh, we need, we need a way to open that. So, we'll check the signs and stuff. Oh, there's an item there. Okay. Nope, oh, can't get over here. There's, oh, there's trainer battles. Okay, so this is probably going to be a two-parter, which works out for me. Because I want to get... I'm going to finish recording this week's stuff. These... So, yesterday's... Or, Monday's episode. This is Wednesday's episode. And then record Friday's. And then I want to wait until after Friday's airs to record the next set. Why did I go in here? I need a max repel. Because I want to get your guys' thoughts on any team changes I need to make. I was just like, wait a second, is anyone injured from that fight? But no, we steamrolled Zapdos. Made that bird our bitch. What's up, bro? Yeah, you thought I was a ghost, but I'm not. I'm a Pokemon master. But yeah, so I want to get your guys' thoughts on any potential lineups I should change before I fight Blaine, if I can. Uh, if not, I'll just... I'll have to fight Blaine, and then we'll make the changes change-ups after that. I mean, it doesn't really... I guess it doesn't matter in the in the long run, since Shades is going to steamroll Blaine and his entire gym by himself, so we're not changing out Shades. We're just not. <laughs> but if we're going to replace Elvira or Joey, um, I want to kind of do that, you know, sooner rather than later, since it's going to be some off-screen grinding. And I figured I'd... I'd get them ready since we have to we're probably gonna have to grind other people up once we get past uh, this gym. I don't know if it's this gym or gym eight, but I know it's before the elite four that we get. Can I kill you with a water pulse? <laughs> Sidetrack. Can I kill eradicate with a water pulse? I can't. Okay, so they're a little bit bulkier than I thought, which I guess makes sense since he outlived an explosion from a electrode. Yeah, that's the word. So I'm pretty sure it's before the Elite Four that we get to go to the Sevi Islands. Is that what they're called? Yeah, the Sevi Islands. Um, which is our link to to Gen 3. Well, you are stuck. Hey, look, it's Mewtwo. What's up, Mewtwo? Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Hey, look, a random button unlabeled. You want to press it? Absolutely. That's right, you do. Crazy kid. Okay, so that locked off that area. And unlock that area, so we'll uh, we'll go upstairs. Oh hey, another Mewtwo. And another trainer. We should probably get some other people some experience. Mm. Guppy. I feel like no matter what happens, these three are not going anywhere. Um, I mean, if you can give me a compelling reason to replace Guppy, I, I could be swayed, but... These two are definitely not going anywhere, and I'm pretty sure Guppy's not. I feel like Paris is pretty good, but I'm open to replacing. And I, it might just be time to let Elvira and Joey go and, and try some new things based on what we have. 
I can't get out. This old place is one big puzzle. It's a house. Are you serious? You are the dumbest looking freaking thief I've ever seen. Like, how shitty of a thief can you be? You have a Charmander, though. That's, I mean, did you steal that? Did you steal it from Team Rocket? Because that's pretty badass if you did. I'll give you points on that. I'm going to paralyze you and then just kind of, I don't know, bite you or something. I don't really have a way to... I don't have anything super effective against Charmander, which is funny because I'm a giant sea serpent. But that'll happen. Anyways, back to my previous topic. If you, you know, lineup changes, just let me know. Uh, probably sometime before Friday, like midday, after Friday's episode comes out. So I'm going to record the new episodes uh, next Saturday for the next week and do any lineup changes based on that. And then, yeah, that'll just continue on. And I'm pretty sure Charmeleon's going to be just as easy as Charmander. Especially when we flinch him. We've been getting a lot of flinches. Just like that. <laughs> and then we miss. Okay, so, yeah. It's funny, because in most Nuzlocke's, I feel like I have the worst luck. Don't burn me. Okay. I was kind of concerned about a burn. Dragon Ridge would kill you. Wow. I was just about talking about how terrible my luck usually is and how I miss a lot of things and all these sad, terrible things. And here we are. Getting flamethrowed by a Charmeleon and missing 100% accuracy Dragon Rages with a Gyarados. Good job, buddy. At least you finished off the Charmeleon. That was pretty good, Guppy. Burglar Arnie. Oh no, my bag of loot. Holy crap. I got 30 bucks. You were stealing 30 bucks from this house? That's your bag of loot? Uh, I did know that. I didn't know that, actually. I'd forgotten. I feel like, well, I did know at one point. I'd just forgotten. Hey, look. A zinc. Ooh. Let's read it. July 10th. We christened the newly discovered Pokemon Mew. Oh, shit. They discovered Mew. That's awesome. They found my favorite Pokemon. I want it. Where is it? Is it still here? This is a door, right? Well, <laughs> walk up to a wall. Is this a door? That was kind of dumb. All right. Guiana, South America. Why is it in South America? Where is Kanto? Is this a real place now? Do Pokemon really exist? Stop breaking the fourth wall, game. Get your shit together. Couldn't you just, like, skip that and say, Diary, July 5th. A new Pokemon was discovered deep in the jungle. Like, why you gotta say that here? Right, or you could name, you could make up a region, like, outside of Kanto. Ah, it's just... Like, I understood when there was only the original generation. They didn't really have the Kanto region and the Hoenn region and all that stuff. And Johto. Kanto, Johto, Hoenn. You know, but I don't know what the other regions are right now. I guess we're gonna kill you, because you should probably give me the experience to get 39. And I was talking while doing this, so. And you're an asshole. Don't. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Fucking. This is why you don't fuck with coughings, man. All these exploding Pokemon. Such assholes. I'm just gonna kill myself and kill you too. Mwah. Well, let's, uh. Guppy's. Guppy's good. Let's. Let's get Shades back in. Tagging Shades. I have no idea why I would walk over here. Or here. Okay. So there's only two switches. So we'll just... Switch you, I guess? No. We can go upstairs. Let's do that first. Alright. Uh, can you not look at me? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you for not looking at me. Gross. What? How'd you impregnate it? Some dude just raping you. Aw, gross. Are you a burglar too? I feel like you're a burglar. It's a mansion. It's called the Pokemon Mansion. Of course you're a burglar. Why do you use the scientist sprite if you're a burglar? Why is your name Simon? Simon's an awful name too. That's an awesome Pokemon though. Aw, man. I... Ninetales, I think, just looks really, really pretty. It's just a really pretty-looking Pokemon. 
I know a lot of people don't like the way it looks, and I never really understood that. Like, I think it just looks so cool. I mean, it's it's got, like, this elegant fox-like. It's got the nine tails, which is, I mean, not realistic, but totally cool. And fits in with a, with a motif being the, like... Japanese mythology, because I mean a lot of some of these Pokemon are based off, well a lot of them are based off random mythos. I was actually reading a thread the other day on, can you please kill him? What is going on here? Stop it. Knock it off. Dude, Shades, get your shit together. Thank you. Like what the hell is that? I was on one of the Pokemon subreddits the other day and reading about like where all the different Pokemon came from or like what they're based on. Uh, he got lost in a box and so I punched him and took 30 bucks off him because apparently he's an idiot. Uh, how much health did you lose? Ah, oh, no, you can totally lemonade. Lemonade up, Shades. Mmm, ah, right in your mouth. I just picture the blaster is like eating a can and everything. Like you hand him a can of carbonated lemonade, and he just like pops him out. Black guard, bah. Anyways, sorry, side topic. We have to look directly at me too. Who wouldn't? I don't know. Normal people. That door stay closed. Huh? What about up here? This door open though. I'm going here. And then we're gonna have to hit this switch at some point. First, we're gonna jack this iron. I like how there's all these power plant looking things here too. Like, what is this doing here? Like everything looks like rubble, but they still have random electronics working. What? I don't know. Let's see. Well, I, I guess we have to do this. Yay. Oh, we have to jump off these ledges. I remember this part. Uh, nah, screw you, bro. I'm going this way. Oh! Oh, I'm fine. Hey, what's up, bro? Dude, there's two burglars upstairs stealing shit. We should take them out. Scientist Ted would like to battle. Scientist Ted sent out the dickest Pokemon ever. Um, well, we know how this goes. Holy crap, predicted. Oh, wow, that, like, Jeff, you are the bulk. You are the bulk of this team. So, I am Jeff. I will squish. Oh, wow. Shades hit 100 special defense? Nice. And then you send out the Pokemon that just gets mind raped by Jeff. That's kind of awesome. I like it. 100% on board with the situation that has occurred. I think this works beautifully. Oh wow, Jeff has higher special defense. Explode is actually a physical attack since I believe it's normal. I'm like 80% sure it's normal. Of course you don't, because you're an idiot. But I'm going to take this. Red found one. Carbos. Where does this go? Will you take me outside? Ah, oh, shit! Seriously? Fuck! Alright, well, that's as good a time as any, I guess. Should we go heal? Nah, we're fine. All right, well, we will continue our exploration of Pokemon Mansion in the next episode. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed that, taking down Zapdos. That was pretty good. And, yeah, if you enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.